In this video, we'll be showing social media management inside of GV Stratus 6.5 using our cross-platform HTML5 interface. So I've launched Chrome and I'm logging into our server using my own login, which is Drew. Once we have logged in, we'll notice the same consistent interface across any device I use. So right here we see that we have Inspector on the right, Asset List in the middle, and Navigator on the left. Over on the Navigator side, we also have a favorite section. This is where I link common groups, folders, monitors, and tools that I use on an everyday basis. So I'm going to go into the Drew group and I'm going to go look into the Boring folder. And as usual, there's nothing in the Boring folder that I actually want. So I'm going to go back into Drew's stuff, and I'm going to go into the Fun folder, where I see a clip called GV Bars and Tone. Once I double click on it, it opens up inside of our Inspector player. This allows me to see audio levels and also to skim frame accurately. Once I'm done playing back the video, I'll go down and look at what kind of metadata I can add to the file. So I'll add a tag that says Fun, and I'll also fill out a description. Now these tags and descriptions will actually go into my social media postings. So now I'll open up the social media tab, which will show me a drop down options, check boxes, total views, likes and shares. So let's go to the drop down, which will show me Facebook, Twitter, YouTube and all social media. Right here, I'm just going to select YouTube. However, nothing's going to happen until this asset has been approved. So I'm going to check the box that says Approve. Normally, this can be done by a manager. But now that the asset has been approved, I'm going to go back over to my Favorites bar and click on the Rules workflow. This now allows me to see the progress of my posting to the YouTube page. It is also modifying the comments so I don't have to check on the progress if I don't want to. Now once the asset starts uploading to YouTube, a new tab will appear inside of Inspector called External Media. So let's click on the External Media tab, which we'll see YouTube and the account it's associated with. We'll also see the URL in which the video is hosted. We can click on the URL, which will show us the video playback and will show us that the full video is there. And now we can go back into Stratus. And we're going to click on the Associations tab. This is going to show us where all of our media is located. And right here you see social media, which I'm going to right click and hit delete on. This is also going to delete it inside of our YouTube account. So let's go back to YouTube and refresh just to make sure. And as you see, it's deleted from YouTube. Thank you for watching and we'll see you next time.